Welcome back to my channel. So electric vehicles are in the range for its performance, looks, range as well as the cool factor. Gone are the days of slow and ugly looking electric vehicles. Now with new technology we face new challenges as well. Fire is one of the main safety concern of an electric vehicle and more importantly why do they even catch fire? So unlike internal combustion powered vehicles where fuel can be drained from a vehicle's tank, there is no sure fire method of removing energy from a vehicle's lithium ion battery where the battery has been damaged in a crash. Because of that, energy remains trapped inside the battery and a process known as thermal runaway can occur, in which battery essentially continuously overheats, overpressurizes, and is prone to fire and sometimes explosions. Another explanation is the quality of the fuel cell. That is, batteries are one of the most expensive components in an electric vehicle. Now, there are few manufacturers who just order the vehicles in bulk from China, where regulations of quality is relaxed in favor of the export industry. And what we get is a relatively economical EV machine. And in a price sensitive market, that's a very important factor. Now to clarify, even international manufacturers have come in the spotlight for their EVs catching fire. Now to extinguish an electric car caught on fire is far more difficult than you may assume. A Tesla Model S which caught fire required nearly 30,000 gallons of water to extinguish it because it kept on reigniting, burning continuously for 4 hours. By comparison, a typical gasoline powered vehicle consumes only 300 gallons of water. In developed countries, the fire brigade does carry a special kind of foam to extinguish EVs. So I hope this video has put some light on the fire hazards that these new electric vehicles may pose. I would love to hear your comments below and as usual, thank you for watching this video and I look forward for seeing you in my next one.